Welcome to Crane Tips, brought to you by Cranes 101 in Bellingham, Massachusetts. Today, let's talk a little bit about rigging. And the first piece of rigging that I would like to talk about is right here in my hands. This is called the web sling. It is the functional portion of what you're going to uh, use to lift um, that is going to wrap around or choke the um, piece that you're lifting. Now this is made out of a very, very strong yarn. And they're so fine, uh, if you ever saw one of these cut, it looks like a really, really, really fine hair. But the strength of this particular sling, which measures two inches wide, in fact, is amazing. This sling here, in a vertical position, like this, is capable of lifting 3,200 pounds, one and a half tons. And if you basket it like this, you've doubled the capacity. So this sling essentially has the capability of lifting what an average car might weigh. So it's a pretty amazing piece of equipment. Now, every sling, is required to have a tag on it. And the tag is gonna tell you what its capacity is in the various con uh, configurations. One is a straight sling, like this. One is a basket, like this. And when the two legs are absolutely vertical, you've doubled the capacity of the sling. And the third, and this is uh, one of the best little pieces of magic for this sling, is called the choke. If you really want to have load control, you can choke it like this. All right, you lose capacity, and that's right here on this label. When you're going to inspect a sling like this, many things that you want to look at, because this is all visual in the inspection. First off, you want to look for stray yarns, any yarns that have um, uh, been cut and that are pulling out of this weave. They're going to... Um, uh, diminish the ability of this sling to do its job. The other thing that you're going to look at is the stitching. Because the lifting on this sling is 100% dependent on this stitching. And occasionally, over the time, the stitching starts to pull out. When it does, um, protocol is to cut the sling in half and throw it away so that nobody else can use it. One of the high mortality items on the sling is the eye, all right? The eye of the sling has to be in as good a shape as the rest of the sling all the time. So you want to check both eyes for cuts because occasionally they do get cut. Remember this one super important notion that you have to remember about web slings and rigging in general. Rigging is disposable and it's no longer serviceable. You have to throw it away and get yourself another sling. And that's the most important little ditty that I wanted to impart to you today. Thank you for listening. My name is Jay. This is Cranes 101, Cranes Tips.